The drying up of the Euphrates River and the appearance of the Golden Mountain in Congo are often associated with signs of the end times. The Euphrates River and the Golden Mountain that shocked the world gave a signal that the apocalypse was near. As the Prophet Muhammad said when the Euphrates River dries up in this country, a mountain of gold will appear. Even the apocalypse would not occur if the Euphrates River had not dried up. And recently the world is excited because the water in the Tigris and Euphrates rivers has caused drought across the country and one area in particular that is in danger of drying up completely is the swamp lakes. Lake Sawa is located northwest of Samoa in the southern province of Suwa. The lake is known for its high salt content and this year's drought has made the fund look like a lump of salt. One of the main reasons for this lake is the decrease in water levels in the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, which are the main source of life for Iraq. The lake has an inlet or outlet which means there is no opening to the shoreline. The water comes from the Euphrates River through a fractured joint where the water flows beneath it. Abdullah, spokesman for Iraq's Ministry of Water Resources, said that the Sawa Lake had completely dried up. This is the first time in the history of Iraq Sawa Lake is heard completely. The problem is groundwater abuse in the area, with low rainfall and climate change. It is known that this area is 5 meters above sea level, with a length of 4.47 kilometers and a width of 1.77 kilometers, water scarcity is a serious problem in Iraq. The impact of the low rainfall in Iraq has been exacerbated as the water levels of the country's two main rivers, the Tigris and the Euphrates, have fallen due to upstream dams in neighboring Iran and Turkey. On the other hand, last February, a golden mountain appeared in the Congo. This is what invites some Muslims to raise these two events as a sign that the world will soon end. Before the Golden Mountain appeared, there were many who interpreted that the mountain of gold referred to in the Prophet's hadith was oil. Understandably, oil is also often referred to as black gold. Such an opinion seems to think that the Golden Mountain is not something real. Before the Golden Mountain appeared, there were many who translated that the Golden Mountain mentioned in the Prophet's Hadith was oil, it's no wonder that oil is also often referred to as black gold. The discovery of a mountain of gold in the African Congo proves that it is wrong to think of a mountain of gold as oil. The Prophet's prophecy about the Euphrates River seems impossible, but is it true that the phenomenon of the dryness of the Euphrates River and the emergence of Golden Mountains in the Congo are signs of the end of times? Everything that happens is the absolute will of Allah, and when the apocalypse will occur only Allah knows.